Hi guys, welcome to a video, and in today's video, I'm just going to be thirsting over Jodie Comer in a suit because I am a tyke. I am a homosexual, and look, that woman wearing a suit does things to me. I do believe if it were biologically possible, also defying the laws of physics since I've never even met her, I just do believe that in an alternate universe, me looking at these pictures would result in pregnancy for me. Jodie Comer is tall and I like a tall woman and she's strong and I like a strong woman. Ah. The woman looks good in a suit. She looks very good in a suit and she is a delicious Liverpudlian cake. I just spat at the camera. It's the thirst, the saliva is upon us, okay. Mm. So here she is in a light beige suit and you know, it's business casual, but also business wearing a suit realness. My God, I know nothing about the corporate world. I am a, a leech on society. I just think she looks so gorgeous in this suit. I think that she looks like she's about to do a PowerPoint on why you should date her, why you should consider her for a date, which is ridiculous because who needs who needs to be convinced when you are Jodie Coma wearing a suit? Not me. Here she is in grey. I especially like the stance here. I like the way that she's, that's a power stance and I think that with her hair slicked back she looks like a beautiful mermaid who had a spell cast on them so now has human legs possibly in exchange for their voice someone should make that into a movie she also has great hands she has great fingers <laughs> respectfully i respectfully and my focus is drawn to her stance oh this is her as villanelle and she is um, a snack here she is in character as villanelle and i really love this scene in killing eve i think this is the scene where she's doing lots of accents and walking around eve and showing off her incredible skills she is a fantastic actor and again the hands in the pocket the power stance she just know she just knows she she's just she's in the know you know <sighs> jesus christ i just think this woman could be james bond she is that smooth in a suit and she just again the hands in the pockets she was blessed she was basically she was born into the world and the fairies were like hey, have some good looks have some tall and handsome vibes but at the same time you're so delicate and pretty and also here's some fantastic acting skills and you're just you're perfect you are a pisces so you're gonna be suffering a lot but you are also you know great i think this is one of my most favorite outfits that she's ever worn because i'm just gonna say it and i know everyone's gonna say like i shouldn't say it but she just looks like a lesbian here and i'm just there's no way to look like a lesbian but if there was this would be it you know and it's the shoes i think it's the shoes and it's oh god it's such a sick cut i shouldn't say the word sick i'm not 14 but it's, it's great the thing is if she walked into a room wearing this I would just start crying I would start crying again just giving 007 very smooth vibes here I also enjoy a diet coke I mean that was probably just a, a prop but it's it does it for me I feel like she's about to ask the most beautiful woman in the room to dance um and I'm gonna be on the sidelines being like I'm so happy for them because I support other women and I don't compare myself, so it's okay. I'm pretty sure this is one of Villanelle's outfits, but it's amazing. Villanelle's wardrobe in season four is my favorite wardrobe because of this, because of stuff like this. She just looks so handsome and masculine and I really, I just enjoy that in a woman a lot. She could have so many women. She could have so many women. I think this is for Vogue. I mean, this suit is very beautiful. She looks like an angel Jesus artist in this suit and um, that's a very cute mole that she has on her chest. I'm appreciating it. Oh, this is one of my favorite photo shoots of hers. I actually bought the magazine. This is a free magazine in London and I had, I paid for this magazine. Don't, don't ask. Anyway, I have two copies of this magazine because I love the way that she looks in this photo shoot so much. I particularly love this photo. I think this is my favorite photo of hers. Again, I know I shouldn't say this, but she is just radiating dyke energy here and I'm appreciating it. I'm not like assuming her sexuality or making any comments about her 
sexuality and that's her business. I'm just saying she's radiating dyke energy. That's I just it's just the facts and we can't let misinformation spread. Okay, so that was me reviewing Jodie Comer wearing a suit. Fantastic. Look, if you're a lesbian, if you're a woman who, you know, radiates an energy which suggests that you might like other women, I don't know, come and join the Sapphic Underground Club. Ooh, baby, do you know what that's worth? The Sapphic Underground Club is a place on Earth. No, that doesn't really work. Heaven is a place on Earth when you join the Sapphic Underground Club. Don't forget to subscribe for instant disappointment and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!